and locals are also reacting tonight to Biden's migration order. Our reporter Manoa Tuiasasopo spoke with local leaders about their thoughts and what this could mean for Yuma County. I spoke with the city of Yuma Mayor Doug Nichols and Yuma County District 4 Supervisor Tony Reyes, who both say this executive order should have come earlier. There are ways to do it right. This is, again, an abuse of the system that the person is trying to stop. Uh, though it's a little late in my viewpoint, it's still better than nothing. Every president, um, didn't matter of party, Republican or Democrat, for the last 20, 30 years has issued policies or executive orders to control the border, except for this president until right now. They share how this executive order can affect immigration in Yuma County. We've had a lot of surge um, of migrants being brought from other sectors to be processed here. Hopefully that'll take those numbers down um, and hopefully give us some stability, but we'll have to wait to see. I think the president got into a situation now where he has to deal with this as a crisis, a national crisis. Whether we have a crisis in Yuma County is still debatable, but whether the, the fact is that there's too many people applying, so it's uh, straining our resources. Supervisor Tony Reyes says that although Yuma isn't currently at the center of the border crisis, it has been in the past. But right now, San Diego and Tucson and, and El Paso and those places are really actually much busier. Mayor Doug Nichols was invited to the White House for the press conference, but could not make it. He says he would have preferred to be a part of the conversation. On a press conference, decisions are made. So I would have preferred to be in the room when these policies were coming together to have input on how, uh, how effective they could be and if there's any other things we could, um, could also do. Both Mayor Nichols and Supervisor Tony Reyes expect this order to be challenged in court. Mayor Nichols says hopefully the challenges don't stick. Reporting in Yuma, Manolo Tuyasasopo.